Hey, what's going on everybody? And today is the day. My name is Chad from Dashlix and we have a brand new reputation management app for you right inside of your dashboard and all of your sub accounts dashboards. It is live today. It is inside of your dashboard. You can go start using it. I'm super, super, super hyped up. This is an app that we've been working on for a couple of months now and we just launched our MVP version, which is the most basic version. So whatever you're seeing here today, it's only going to get better. So let me give you a quick walkthrough. Now you will actually see a brand new app inside of your app drawer, which is called Reputation. And if you'll notice, it has a little green beta badge on it, which basically means this app is gonna be in beta for the next 30 to 60 days as we work out any kinks along the way. But for the most part, the app is working great. It's inside of your dashboards and it's ready to use on all accounts. I'm gonna give you a quick tour, show you how to use the app and show you all the cool features that you can do uh, to make sure that you can get the most out of it. So first and foremost, um, if you come to this page, you will probably see that you don't have any data and you'll see a button here that'll tell you to connect the source. Right now we connect to two major sources. We connect to Google My Business and then we also connect to your Facebook business page. So you can connect either of those two sources. You can see that here on the left rail. Right now, uh, just for the sake of the demo, I've connected our Google My Business account at Dashlix. As you can see, we have 253 reviews on there. I'm gonna go through and just kind of show you guys exactly um, what you can do with the platform. So uh, just like all the other apps, um, very similar layout. So you just learn it one time and, and you're ready to kind of rock and roll. On the left here, we have the filters. Um, for the first thing you're gonna see on the top left is needs response. This is actually going to pull in all the reviews from all the sources you have connected and it's also going to pull in the responses as well. As you can see right here, our team has responded to this review from within the Google My Business platform and we pulled that data in, okay? What this is used for is reputation management. If you're getting reviews, you wanna be able to make sure you respond to every single review. So I can literally just click this filter and boom, these are all of the reviews that our team has not yet responded to. And not only um, can I respond to them inside of the platform, but this all happens in real time. So I can literally just go in here um, and uh, let's go to this person. Thanks for the awesome review. And I just click reply and boom, automatically you'll see that the reply is actually there. Uh, I can actually go to the review or I can copy the link to the review right here. So this is real great. Um, you can see how easy this is because now I can literally go review by review and actually start replying to all of these reviews. You can also now start offering reputation management services to your clients because look how easy it is for you now to just go and create a list of reviews and just copy and paste and just respond to all the good reviews and then respond to all the bad reviews. I can also filter and I can say, hey, you know what? I wanna grab all of the four star reviews. There's 13 of them. Let me grab all of these and let me respond to these. Or maybe we have some bad reviews. Let me respond to some of the bad reviews that we might have, right? And make sure that we actually get our reputation up. Okay, so as you can see, there's a bunch of filters here. Uh, need response will filter out all of the reviews that obviously need a response. Your ratings. So it, the way that Google works is Google goes by star ratings. Facebook has now changed that. Facebook now goes by recommendation. So either thumbs up or thumbs down, as you can see here. So you can actually filter that out. Once I hook up Facebook, which I'll do right now. Um, so if I go over here, show you how to hook up a new source, as you can see, Google My Business is already connected. I'm going to get Facebook in there. So we'll go to Facebook. There we go. Boom. Uh, I'll go ahead and select dash clicks to get all of my reviews in there. Awesome. Now what's going to happen is in real time, without even you refreshing the page, our system is going to go out to that source and it's going to collect all the reviews that you have and it's going to actually pull them into the system. Also, as you get new reviews, our system updates literally every couple of minutes. So as a new review comes in, we're going to be populating that into the dashboard for you guys as well. So that's basically how you pull all of your reviews into the dashboard. Um, everything else is pretty much self-explanatory. Obviously, you just pull reviews in, manage them, and answer the reviews. But the, one of the really cool things that we've added is a way for you to actually request reviews. So you can go over here and you can do this two ways. You can either copy the link right and you can manually send this to your clients and this will bring them to a review page 
right where they can actually go and uh, click on let's say um, you know I want to leave a review on Facebook so it'll click on here it'll take them directly to your Facebook page where they can actually go and leave a review all right uh, now if I go to the second option I can click send review requests and what this is you can automated uh, automatically send out an email or a text message or both if I want to a specific client so let's just say as an example uh, I want to go ahead and send an email and, uh, and an SMS so I just click continue um, just like every other thing that we have in the dashboard you go and you select all of your contacts that you want so if I want to start you know selecting these uh, specific contacts uh, I can go ahead and do that uh, and then I click next right and it'll bring you to this screen and then I can just go ahead and click continue and boom my review requests have been sent off It'll send those people a beautiful white labeled email and a text message, uh, bringing them to our page where they can actually go and leave a review with a nice little message that says, hey, uh, thanks for choosing us. Please, uh, if you don't mind, share your review, uh, share a review with us. All right. So that's how you can actually collect reviews. You can respond to reviews and manage them. And then you can actually send out review requests to go and collect more reviews. Now we can go to the reporting page. And on the reporting page, we can actually see what's happening with our reputation and our reviews. So you can see here we have a review summary, and this is going to basically give us an aggregate total of all of our reviews. Um, it's also going to show us how much reviews we got in the last 30 days. Uh, here it will show us the sources that are connected and how many reviews we have and what the reputation looks like for those reviews. Here it's going to show us the best and worst month. Here it's also going to show us the reviews over time, so I can literally go month over month and see how many reviews we've got. We can see that in June 2020, we collected 93 reviews just from Google, right? So this is a very useful app. You can actually use this once again to start managing the reputation for your agency, but not only that, for your customers as well. So I'm super excited. I hope you guys love it and start using it. We're going to be adding tons of different review sources here uh, in the next couple of months so that's an, a bunch of new features to the apps as well uh, just to make it 10 times better so once again hope you guys enjoy and i'll see you guys in the next video have a good one